So a couple of weeks ago, I was in Fountainhead Park uh, with a friend of mine, we were fishing. We rented a John boat that came with a 55 pound thrust uh, outboard motor, one of those electric ones. And I gotta say, I was very unhappy with it. Uh, I think the fastest we were able to go was like two miles an hour. And um, it's not even that, it's, I had to get a second battery after two or three hours of use because the electric I guess it run, runs out of charge very quickly and I just don't want to go through that again. Uh, I think we spent $56 on the engine rental and the two batteries. So on a six hour period that can definitely add up. Uh, so I ended up buying a 52cc two stroke outboard engine and we're going to see how that performs and if uh, we're going to see if it's worth the $233 that I paid for it. So far, I'm pretty impressed with what I've seen unboxing it. Uh, it was very well packaged. Comes with a toolkit. Mixing container, funnel to fill the fuel tank with the motor itself, controller with an on off switch and the throttle, uh, the bracket to mount it onto the John boat and the propeller shaft assembly itself. So I've never actually had any sort of outboard motor before. Uh, so I'm not too familiar with how this is assembled, but this is good uh, for finding out whether or not it's going to be easy for you if uh, if you've never never done this before yourself The uh, assembly was pretty easy to figure out. The This pretty much came already pre-assembled. You don't have to do anything. You do have to install the bracket onto it. I did the permanent style one. It does swing on and off if you turn it around. And then you just mount the controller directly on the swivel point and then there's an on off switch over here harness is just red to red black to black this is the more complicated one though you do have to manually hook that up yourself to the throttle body which i'll show you how to do in a minute um the motor itself bolts right on to the assembly with these four allens then there's a clutch in there so when you uh when you throttle it enough, it will engage the, the propeller. As far as the tool set that it came with, uh, I can't say I'm too impressed with it. Uh, very cheap quality, but it actually got the job done, so I can't really complain. In order to access the throttle body, first step is to remove the airbox cover. This throttle cable when you turn the controller, this cable comes in and out of it. And what we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna have to hook it over here. This is the throttle body. But in order for the cable to spring back on its own, we're gonna need to add the spring. Now that we know that there's a decent amount of tension there, that it springs itself back, we can now put the lock nut on and tighten it in place.
time to reinstall the intake cover. Should be ready to use. I just noticed that it actually came with a spec sheet that says 20 kilometers per hour for four people, which I extremely doubt, but we will test that out later on today. Uh, and it says 3.6 horsepower. Um, everything else looks pretty accurate except for this 20 kilometer an hour with four people, which I really doubt. If I were to guess, maybe eight miles an hour. We'll find out. Since this is a two stroke engine, we're gonna have to mix some two cycle oil into the fuel. Uh, we're gonna follow a 30 to one ratio, eight ounces oil, two gallons of fuel. Turn off? I do. So we finally ran out of gas after what? An hour. An hour, hour and a half of use. Yeah, dude. You like my fish? Yo, is that like bait or you actually caught something? Oh, dude, I hooked him in the eye. That looks like something I you would You should get out bait. of the reeds. <laughs> Right, guys i would have to say that that 233 dollar purchase for a outboard motor was a success that thing did not give up whatsoever it started first time every time every time and it got us up to 12 miles an hour at one point but it did average maybe about eight eight and a half miles an hour but that's pretty much what i expected so yeah if you do want it if you if you want to give it a shot yourself i got the links in the description for where you can get it if you found any of this information useful make sure you smash that like button and if you like this kind of content make sure you subscribe to my channel but for today this is going to be it thank you for watching